We're hearing from a woman who fell at Arches National Park and was helped by a primetime TV star who was on a hike with her own family. Fox 13's Aaron Cox has that story. I'm trying to make it. Delicate Arch has been on Minnie John's bucket list for as long as she can remember. I'm obsessed with Utah, Arizona, and Nevada. Minnie says her desire to hike up the arch was sheer absurdity because she's in her late 50s with diabetes and has an artificial knee. Save myself from having to hike up to all the other areas just because I wanted to hike up here. Yet the hike was steeper than Minnie expected. And on Monday evening, about 15 minutes before she reached the arch, Minnie began to feel dizzy. My husband and my son said, OK, let's just wait here. We'll I said, no, 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 it's getting late. You just go. I'll just sit here and I'll wait for you. So I sat there. I held my head in my hands, leaning forward because uh, I just wanted to feel the breeze. It's one of the last things Minnie remembers before she passed out, falling face forward, fracturing her nose. The next thing I know, I, I am hearing a, a voice that sounded so familiar and just telling me, hello, ma'am, ma'am, are you OK? That was the voice of Julie Bowen, best known for her role as Claire Dunphy in the TV series Modern Family. Julie was hiking the trail with her sister, who just happens to be a doctor. I realized uh, no one's going to believe this story, so I said, uh, can I have a picture? She bandaged me up really well, cleaned it up just like the Good Samaritan. She did her thing and she was so, so sweet. And they were so humble because then not neither one of them mentioned their names. So she said, you know, you should be fine. Uh, she made sure that I had family to go down, take me back down. A gesture and a trip Minnie will never forget. If they weren't there at the right time, I could have any scenario, I could have been lying there and bleeding and, and whether they were stars or not, I think anyone and everyone who helped, you know, would be the same. They would be the greatest. Says. Minnie says she passed out not because she didn't have enough water, but because she needed more electrolytes. She had just returned from the doctor when I spoke with her and had her stitches removed. She says her nose will be fully healed within six weeks. In Salt Lake County, Aaron Cox, Fox 13 News, Utah. By the way, Bowen's sister, Dr. Annie Lutkemeyer, is an infectious disease specialist at the University of California, San Francisco. Wow.